Bam! Right there. How's it going, guys? Token Vaping with another Juice Review. Now, this is one that I've been hearing a lot of buzz about recently, and I obviously, you know, trying to make a bigger name for myself and my reviews, I wanted to do a review on this just because it just, it looked cool. It's the, the flavor sounded really, really unique. Um, so it's a single flavor. I have a company that's ba that's based in Michigan, I believe. Um, you can go to the website. I will give you all of that information um, here in a minute. But as I've started been doing a little bit more, as I'm doing it now, a lot of people have been saying that, you know, waiting until the end part of my video to do the actual review and flavor profile seems a little long for them. And I've been trying to cut down the amount of time my videos are. So I'm going to jump into the flavor first, do the vape, describe the flavor, my opinion on that, and then I will give you all the back, back information that I have on the company itself and things here and there. So without further ado, we are going to dive into the flavor. Now, I would have just shown you the bottle, but I think that packaging, the way that they box this is really cool. It's Valer, Valar, Valare. I'm gonna say it's Valer, but this is the box that comes in and it's a slide open box and there is the bottle. And I just wanted to show that, which is why I left it in the box. Um, this was sent to me for the sole purpose of this review. Um, and it comes with this, which I will get into in a second. And I'm not really good at grabbing stuff around the corner like that. So this is the bottle. And it, this is just really, really slick. So I will get into this here in a second. But as you can see, it does have a safety ring underneath so that it is secure you can twist this all you want to. So this is a first vape, first review, as always, that I do for you guys. It is going on a fresh cotton, wicked up right there. Quick shout out to USV, United Society of Vape for the USV LMUD that I use on my reviews. And my Texas Stuff Cotton. And I have reviews on my channel on the mod that was sent to me for the review and on the cotton as well. If you guys have been watching my reviews, you know I've been using this cotton pretty much. It's the only cotton I use. Wicks really well. Um, especially if you're on the go and um, I just like the fact that it has little to no break in time so you get a lot of flavor right off the bat which a lot of cotton I've tried so far it's not the same so uh, that link will be in the comment box below if you are interested in the cotton now the reason why this flavor struck me as as unique is because this has a subtle hint of vanilla with a smooth cream and a drizzle of maraschino reduction so basically, it's if you've ever cooked or baked and you use maraschino cherries, if you uh, reduce them, which basically just means you, you boil them and then just drop it down to a low simmer and just basically simmer it down, down, down. There's a thick, uh, like a thick, heavy syrup that it turns into, and that's got a, a phenomenal flavor and a great smell, which you definitely get out of this. I mean, if you've ever had anything to do with maraschino cherries, you know this smell. It smells really good, actually. So we're going to pop this open. And you hear the safety ring. It should pop. There it goes. And you can see there, it's not super dark or anything like that. But that is all cherry smell. And it just, when you open the bottle, it literally just floods your nostrils. So I'm going to go ahead and do the drip on this real fast. I will do a couple of hits, see what the flavor feels like, tastes like. You'll get to see the vapor production off of it. And then I'll do a quick re-drip just to ensure, especially with this, this, I guess you could say, heavy, hearty, succulent flavor. Um, I want to make sure that I do not miss anything in the flavor to inform you of this. Because, like I said, this is not a common flavor. I've not seen many juice companies um, use a maraschino cherry flavor. I honestly off the top of my head I can't think of any right off the bat um, so this definitely is something that is not common across the board which is uh, what this company was going for as far as I'm aware um, this flavor has been in the making for about a year or so so they've definitely put the work into this so as always I'm vaping at 75 watts and this is uh, Valer and uh, the company is Valera. I don't think there's a specific name for the flavor itself, though. Definitely good solid clouds. Okay, so get a good two hits on that. 
get that working into the cotton a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and do a quick re-drip as I stated. It's just to ensure that the flavor that I'm getting out of this is what it's supposed to be and I'm getting all of it and that I'm not going to miss out on something. So that's why I'm doing the re-drip just to see if there's anything in the flavor that I might have overlooked the first time. Especially since being fresh cotton you don't always get the full flavor on, on the first couple of hits. Okay, I am not going to lie about this flavor. If you are a dessert vapor, if you are looking for something that is different or unique, if you are looking for something that has a, a hearty, rich flavor hit to it, look no further than right here, Valere. This is probably one of the closest flavors that I've tasted to an actual like a hearty dessert and I mean that like most people think desserts they think like a pie or ice cream or things like that I mean they're simple desserts um, not simple to make in some cases but they're they're considered simpler desserts you know they're more common you know you go to a family dinner or collect a, a, a group like that and everybody always has like a pie or a cobbler or um, ice cream or things like cake but this this definitely feels like something that you would order at like a, a fancy restaurant. You know, it has that that luxury feel to it that, you know, it's not something that you would make on a regular basis because it's time consuming. It, it's, it involves, you know, uh, a lot of effort, so to speak, you know, and but it's something that you would definitely want to make for a special occasion. Um, flavor wise, it is packed with a heartiness to it. I mean, you definitely vape it and you feel you feel it you know that you're getting, you know, a, a, a flavor, a, a rich flavor hit out of this. The vanilla just slams you right in the beginning, at least for me. And everybody's got a different sensitivity and taste preference, but the vanilla slams right into, right into the vape right off the bat, instantly smooths into that to a cream type feel. And the ending and the aftertaste is all that maraschino cherry reduction. Um, it's definitely a, it's, it's a definite, very dessert style flavor. Um, this is the bottle. It is a 60 ml bottle. This is the size that it is offered in. It is offered in, um, a zero, 1.5, a three, a six and a 12. So they do cover a decent spectrum of nicotine users, but they only have the one size. So that's how they can give or take. They don't offer, you know, a gazillion different things here and there and just, end up having to make it cost more. Um, check out their website. It's Valare, V-E-L-A-R-E dot VIP, V-I-P. And it'll instantly take you to that site. I know everybody's used to the dot com, but this is dot VIP. This is the bottle. It has a chrome plating on this. And that's what the little gift that they provide you with is for as well. But it is a chrome finish on the bottle. It has the nicotine and the bottle size, all the warning and ingredient labeling on the back. It does have their address and it does have the big warning label. Um, it has the big warning label here for the TPT compliancy and then their logo as well. Now, the box itself, like I said, is really cool. It has a little quick description about the flavor and then it has the warning. It has their just the ingredients and their uh, address here and then the fronts are basically the same and it is the slide open. And then it has the little bit on the back here. Um, it's just basically saying that you are cordially invited to participate in the pinnacle of vaping indulgence. So they want this to be a, lux a more luxurious luxury uh, feel to it, the vape to make you feel and know that when you vape this, you're vaping something of like high society style, but for a an affordable price. The little gift that they include with it, which is kind of cool. And I, as I was saying, it's, it goes back to the chrome, the chrome finish on the bottle. It's a little cleaning cloth with their logo on that, which is kind of slick too. I mean, it comes with it, but it's to keep the bottle so that it always has that reflective sheen to it. So that when you open it up, it doesn't, it's not all fingerprint smudged and everything like that. But definitely check them out. It's Valer.Vip. They're on Instagram, they're on Facebook, they're on Pinterest, I believe. Um, but they are covering social media. They're on Twitter as well. So definitely, uh, definitely give them a look into. And like I said, if you're looking for something unique, if you're looking for something that is a solid uh, dessert flavor that is different than the, than the norm, um, definitely check out Valer. It is, it is definitely worth having if you are a dessert vapor. Um, even if you're looking for something new and you want to find that, that, that first flavor to break into the dessert style flavors, 
this is definitely a go-to one that, that I would definitely try um, if you like any anything to do with desserts. Um, definitely give them a try. Valer, thank you so very much for the opportunity. Um, this is their logo. Just simple. It's simplistic, but it gets the point across, and it's very slick. Thank you so very much for the opportunity to, to review your line. Um, as always, guys, I'm Token Vaping. I'm here on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, and Pinterest. Anything that I can do to help further enhance your vaping experience and make it more enjoyable for you is the only reason why I do this. So definitely reach out to me. Let me know if you have any questions, comments, concerns, a particular video that you'd like to see. I will do everything in my power to make that happen. Um, but until next time, no matter what, always, always remember, truly love yourself. Vape on, vape strong, guys. Have a good one.